New video for today. Kenwood. We're going to show you how to adjust the displays and backgrounds on the new Exelon radios. So stay tuned. So when you first power up the unit for the first time, you get all these options. One of them right here is user customization. If you go ahead and select enter, it's going to take you to the background page. There's nine preset backgrounds to choose from, as well as one do-it-yourself. We'll get to that in a second. You also have panel color. Panel color are these over here. You can select whatever color you'd like those to light up, as well as come into user and create your own. So if you're trying to match a specific color in your dash, you can do that here. You can also turn on and off the dimmer. You can also pick scan, in which case these colors will just change randomly. Now once you're done or have it set up to how you like, just select X, you can go finish up in the home menu. Now if you had it installed, obviously you missed out on that setup. So you want to select gears, display, user customize. Now this will take you back to those same features we just looked at. Now let's look at adding an image. The first thing you need to do is create an image. The image needs to be 800 by 480. It needs to be in a JPEG format. You need to export it to a thumb drive and you're going to plug it into the one and only USB that the radio has. So what we want to do now is import our own image to change the background. To do that, we want to X out of here, select USB from source, on file type, switch it until it says photo, select the home button once the image appears, go back to gears, Go to display, select user customize, and now you'll be able to select capture. So you can zoom in if you like, you can move it around, move it up, you can move it down. Then when you have it just the way you like it, select capture, select yes, and now it will be here selectable for you. So if you're on this one here, you can select that there, select close, Go back to your home, and there you go. Now you have your own usable back, your own custom background. And you can overwrite it as many times as you want. You can only have one active at a time, but you can change it to anything you want. So what do you think, man? I think it's cool. It's That's nice. right. It allowed, you know, any radio that allow you to change the background and customize it to your dash is definitely the way to go. Most of these do that now, thankfully, because that is one of the questions you guys ask a lot of, is can I change the background so it'll match? My interior, these will do them. So awesome. Bring it to an end. All right, so thank you for watching. You guys can find us on Facebook, YouTube, and Instagram. And as usual, we greatly appreciate you guys. We do these things five days a week, nonstop action and adventure. You guys have a good night, and we will see you later next time. Bye.